so hi everyone you can see this is the lcr resonance apparatus with built in sine wave oscillator so this is the apparatus itself we have all the components we don't require here a asg audio signal generator because it is a built in sine wave oscillator so here are the components you can see so i will explain you this is the fine tuner used to multiply the frequency here you can see this is the knob used to set the frequency 100000 and 10k so here if you keep in this uh, 100 frequency then you can use it as a multiplier 1 into 100 100 1.5 means 1.5 into 100 so 150 hertz so 2 into 100 200 hertz so like that you can use this as a multiplier for the selected frequency so you can also change it to 1k like 10k so then this is this you knob used to set the amplitude and this is the knob used to set the resin resistance and here is the capacitor capacitance you can set using this knob so here you can uh, set the amplitude uh, for selected value you can note down the current so you can uh, set the amplitude how much uh, you are going to have here and the for applied frequency you should note down the current here so here you can see this is a lcr resonance apparatus for uh, series resonance also parallel resonance so you can perform both the experiment here so this is the component for series connection and this is for parallel so lcr as we know inductor capacitance and resistor so here is the resistance inductance and capacitor so you can connect uh, here according to the given terminals so let us make the connection for series lcr resonance circuit so first we should connect the voltmeter negative terminal to the negative and positive terminal to the positive terminal and then emitter positive terminal to the emitter positive terminal for series connection and negative terminal to the negative terminal so next we have to connect the resistance to the resistance one end and another to the resistance to set the resistance value and then so here is the capacitor connect cap and inductance value is fixed not not necessary to connect its value is fixed so here i am going to connect this capacitor so this inductance value is 13 henry so capacitor value can change by connecting to this terminal so and you can change it in this mode so here is the connection and one more connection you have to make here amplitude so connect amplitude here positive terminal to the positive terminal and then negative terminal to the so here is the knob to set the frequency and this is the multiplier this is the knob to set the voltage and uh, here you you have different values of resistance 50 to 200 ohm so any one of them you can select uh, 50 75 100 up to 200 and here also capacitance you can see 0.12 up to 0.5 microfarad so you can select any one of the capacitance value so let us take for 50 ohm and 0.1 microfarad and uh, set the value of 
amplitude using this knob switch on the device and here you can use 100 hertz or 1k hertz range or 10k hertz so i am i kept it on 1k hertz so let us switch on the device first you need to set the amplitude so let us uh, take the amplitude of 3 volt and then uh, you can start taking the reading for you should note on frequency and current reading here oh, amplitude is going to be fixed value uh, and oh, as you frequent as you increase the frequency current should increase and after that if even though if you increase the frequency current should decrease so exactly at uh, certain value of current you are going to have the amplitude that is what we call resonance frequency so resonance frequency theoretically also you can calculate by multiplying the resonance frequency formula is equal to what 1 divided by 2 pi under root l into c sorry uh, inductance value you can multiply 13 henry and the capacitance value which one you have selected you will get the theoretical resonance frequency you should um, compare with the experimental resonance frequency by plotting the graph of current versus frequency so this is how you can do this experiment similarly you can uh, make the connections for parallel also as uh, they have given here uh, the resistance inductance and capacitance terminals you should connect and you can perform parallel resonance circuit uh, you similarly you should set the amplitude and set the resistance and capacitance value and then vary the frequency and use the multiplier for uh, the frequency how much you applied and note down the current then you can plot the graph of current versus frequency you will uh, you are going to have the resonance frequency of for LCR as well as LCR series as well as parallel.